Hello and welcome to another video. We are going to be going through our Vegan Kind Lifestyle Box. Um, it came, I'm ashamed to say, like about um, five, four days ago or so, but it's we got guinea pigs. <laughs> I don't need to say any more than that, really. We got guinea pigs, so that's been most of what little we've baby been. Guinea pigs. Little baby guinea pigs. Um, I'm sure they'll feature on our channel very, very soon. So we're going to get stuck in. For those of you who don't know, the Vegan Kind box. This is the lifestyle box. It is a subscription that comes um, directly to your door, either a one-off, once a month, once every two months. Um, you choose, and it is just thirteen ninety-five reduced. Um, by how long you sign up for and it is a box and it's got food and also something under the broad category of lifestyle <laughs> so, so yeah you had yeah. the deodorant last time and um, what else have we had? Yeah, we've had candles had, we've had um soap we've had soap Cacao yeah soap. so something for your lifestyle that is also vegan so let's get stuck in kids there are so many things I've seen in here that I'm so excited to try. I can't believe I've managed to hold off for this many days. Yeah, now I'm going to I've been this I've been talking to um, Katie on Instagram. So um, hi Katie, you say I'm really gonna if I love Chris, I'm gonna love these because these are banana chips. Okay. So they're banana chips, however, Unlike normal banana chips, these aren't sweetened. Yeah, I'll put them in a second. They, these aren't sweetened. They are salt and vinegar flavoured. I know. That actually I know. sounds really What's nice. That? <laughs> Look at your little face. You might really like it, the banana face. So, they're... So I was expecting banana chips, you know, like you get like just the fry, essentially the fried parts. But look at these. We've got some over there. They look like, yeah, they can't see over in my kitchen, yeah. babe, thank goodness, because, you know. Um, so let's chip those out in there. Oh my gosh. They smell just like salt and vinegar. They're the texture of crisps as well. So um, where's my book gone? I don't know. Oh, I've lost my book. So I've got the book and really say um, comment on all of these lovely brands are amazing, amazing producers. They're ones that you wouldn't normally find in supermarkets and these are being handed over. So not not a fan, no, okay, that's okay. So these are um, the the where are they? Um, they're number two. So Katie's Food and Co. Savory Salt and Vinegar Banana Crisps. A healthy alternative to the traditional crisps. We're so excited when we received these samples. Um, so they were wrapped in when they came to vegan kind. They were wrapped in tissue paper, decorated with bananas. <gasps> I want tissue paper with bananas on. Oh, comment below where I can oh, find some like of that. that. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I bet it's their own. Oh, gosh, so lucky. Anyway, these crisps will satisfy your cravings and make your tummy happy. Eat good, feel good. These new banana crisps are vegan, all natural. They don't contain contain preservatives and they are one of your five a day. The non-GMO contain zero grams of trans fat, are dairy and gluten free. And they are lower in sugar too as green or unripe bananas are much lower in sugar content. Perfect, so they don't use the ripe bananas and that's why they're not as sweet. Are you having fun with that piece of cardboard, my mm -hmm. sweetheart? Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. awesome. So reading on the packet per pack, it, but they're only 2.3 grams of saturated fat and those are the bad guys that are in all the other yummy things that we love. So they are delicious. I reckon They're the giant so is so going to love them. He's really going to enjoy them. You tried another one. So for someone who doesn't like them, you keep going into it. Hmm. They have got like a hint of banana. Well, I hate them. But yeah, they are, they are. I really like them. Katie's on Instagram. If I like crisps, I like these. And you are right. I do like them. They're really <laughs> yummy. <laughs> I really do like them. So a bit scared. I'm going to put them right out of the, I'm going to leave them. I don't know where to put them. I'm going to leave them there. We've got a new setup. And I don't want to put them there because I will just see this little hand over there going. So is this your next plate, next one to try then? Oh, is we've it? had one of these before. Have we? It's Captain Kombucha. We've had a drink before. We, we have had a drink there. 
Um, we've, we have had drinks before, that is something to say. Normally there is a drink as well in these, but we've had, we get all sorts of food, which you can see on the channel above, we get snack surprise box and there's normally a drink in there. So lots and lots of lovely different drinks to try. And this is a, the Gutsy Captain Kombucha. Now those of you that don't know what kombucha is, it, this one is actually Europe's number one kombucha brand. So Captain Kombucha, it's the one what to go for. Kombucha? What is kombucha? I hear you ask. This is kombucha is a um, a green tea fermented culture. So it's a fermented drink, like they ferment alcohol, but there's no alcohol content in it. Um, so nothing else, just 100% kombucha. Pardon? So a drink for me at parties. It's a yeah. It's a green tea fermented with organic raw cane sugar and a culture of live bacteria and yeast. So just like you would brew beers, um, then that's sort of kombucha, but it doesn't get alcohol in it yet. So we're gonna try this one. We opening it to try, guys? My yeah. best friend, Luan, she loves kombucha. Absolutely loves it. But, um, mm -mm. Uh -oh. <laughs> it's busy, it's busy. <laughs> I'll have to put the straw in there and try. It's a really subtle raspberry flavor, it's lovely. Oh, it's really nice. Just try it. Just try You were shaking your head and saying yuck before it even entered your mouth. <laughs> you okay? Not a fan? Not a fan? Yeah? No? We I like love it. it. Thank you, Captain Kombucha. We love it. So, what was the next one you wanted we were desperate to try, my lovely? This one. Milk chocolate bar. I am purposely going to save this till last because the reason being with chocolate and the reason we love chocolate so much is when it when you eat it and it melts it coats your mouth and then you want, that's all you can taste which is why when you finish one chocolate bar you really want another because you can still taste it in your mouth so we will eat that but we'll try it in a minute why don't we um show the guys our lifestyle <gasps> project yeah. part so this smelled as soon as the box came and i opened it i could smell it it is such a lovely smell. Yeah, body bar. This is foamy body bar, and look at this. It is 100% plastic free. Peppermint oil and green tea is one of the flavors, but you might also get an orange one, which I can't see what, what um, oh, it might say in the in instructions. Actually, it probably said in here, um, yeah, or papaya and oat milk. So we got the, the um, green tea mint one, which is such a great feeling. Mint in a morning shower. What do you think? Can you smell it? One, two, three. It's like a soap on a rope, but it is so cute. It's got all these bubbles on it for like massaging in the shower or in the on your hands. You can leave it on the tap. It okay, is that lush. That smells really good. It does smell good. Yeah, like it smells between. like camping. Rub, it smells like camping. Okay. Yeah, probably go camping. Play spa underwater. Rub between your palms to create a lather. Massage onto wet skin in the shower or bath. Rinse and hang to dry. And it is 100% plastic free. The box is plastic free. The ribbon is plastic free. This is plastic free. So you're looking after your body, your, ma your mind, probably, because you're not going to feel guilty about polluting the planet. But yeah. yeah, great. And it smells good. And I think the mint will give you clarity of mind. We'll go with that. So next, can we try this? It is a breakfast. So I propose we leave it for breakfast another day do you think oh boo okay fine granola can be at any time of the day <laughs> granola can be any time of the day awesome um fuel 10k granola pot T fuel 10k chocolate is the perfect quick or on the go breakfast granola pot so this comes ready rip the lid off pop in your milk of choice Add your favourite plant milk. The yummy pot is a source of protein, it's high fibre and added vitamins. Suitable for vegetarian or vegan diet. So now, good. we watch, we absolutely are completely devoted fans to um, Good Mythical Morning. Yeah. And they recently tried cereal with different things other than milk. So, you water is actually water. 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 And cream soda. And cream soda. And chicken stock. Oh uh, yeah, no, we're not. We're yeah, probably we're not, not going to put chicken, chicken so It wasn't a goer. Um, but yeah, cream soda on this. Should we try a little bit? Have you tried any? So, are you going to try a piece? Because, hmm, 
in Granona in itself. She just stole a chocolate bit. I'm sure. That's no, alright, that's what she wants. It 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 tastes delicious. Hmm. It'll definitely be yummier with some liquid. <laughs> but you just love those banana crisps. For someone who didn't like them, they're a big hit, aren't they? So I like that too. Yeah. The 70 gram pot, um, it's only got 14 grams of sugar in it, which isn't very bad for granolas on the market. They are normally absolutely rammed with sugar. So this one's really good and it's gonna make a lovely breakfast tomorrow. Really lovely. So why don't we go some more crisps before we go more sweet? Yeah? Or should we do a bar? We've got three bars to choose from. Bar, 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 bar. We're doing that one last. Okay, we've got two bars. Oh, mallow puffs. We've got mallow puffs. Salted caramel mallow bar dunked in Belgian dark chocolate. I cannot wait to get my mouth around this. And I'm we've got so excited for that one. Peanut, peanut butter, butter chocolate is my chip. My favourite thing. We ever. love Lara bars. They are so yummy. Peanut butter Let's is a massive favourite in this house. We can just eat it and eat it and eat it. Um, peanut butter so, fingers. So you can see. But they're shocking. No, no, no. <laughs> Is here, don't we, kids? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think so. I've got my knife because <laughs> it's a bit open. So, the Lara bar. Um, oh, okay, you're having that whole piece nice. I was gonna cut that in half. You totally got your fingers on. <laughs> this is peanut butter chocolate chip snack bar. The yummy snack bar was inspired by truly iconic flavor combination. Who doesn't love peanut butter and chocolate? You don't love it. <laughs> you know, you I like that. This, she'll like it in a minute. Just give her a minute with natural peanuts delicious chocolate chips along with simple real ingredients so it's mostly it's got two dates ten peanuts and chocolate chips in good. and we make our own date bar from now how many ages this one's pretty good but this one because they, they have such a path though and they really are to make your own but this is chocolate. delicious <laughs> i'm just going to pick the chocolate out of it mm. <laughs> okay so anyone who has ever made a video for youtube and done any editing will know that there is a lot of pause go up get oh i forgot my knife or i forgot this and every time i get up and go there this little hand goes mm, into the crisp some nom 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 don't you yeah you do but at the start you didn't like them and now you're like yeah i love them so i'm gonna go with another crisp now what do we think of the lara bar just, why are you telling me? It's amazing. <laughs> you live with me. You can tell me all the time. There we go. Oh, thumbs down from Josh. She's not a massive fan of that. So, that is okay. I'm going to move this box out of the way now. Let's have a bit more. Oh, get the chocolate back. Thank you, Heather and Susan, who packed our box. It tells you who packs it, which I think is a great touch. Yeah. So, next up, we have chili crisps. These are going to be a bit spicy. These are chili, cheese, and onion. And they are proper big crisps. <gasps> Mr. Sings are amazing crisps, only made using British potatoes, hand cooked deliciousness, and they're going to be spicy. <laughs> I'm such a chili addict, I just love it. I love that level of heat that these are. We you eat it and it's like, mm, it's nice and spicy. Oh, it's quite hot, it's quite hot. And to get, they are, oh, okay, no, I'm all right. <laughs> and to get a vegan cheese crisp that tastes like that and that good, that is a hit. Really, absolutely mild kudos to you too. guys, Mr. Singh. Mr. That's Singh. actually pretty spicy and it's mild chilli. Yes. It is quite mild chilli. It says it's got a hint of chili herbs and the perfect crunch. And it has got the perfect crunch. It really does. It does have a really good crunch. We weren't going to make that last, but actually I'm quite glad we're going to have this one last because I know, I just know this They're is going to be my favourite. They're ready in They're ready in Well, that's okay. Mine on the half. So like it the, does. So, like so this vegan chocolate we have had before. And it we have we definitely bought like this that. because you... This is Love Raw Vegan. There was in a few boxes a while ago. There was a Love Raw and it is so good. Oh, it's so good. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, you have an auto spit. Okay. <laughs> it is so good. That'll go mm -hmm. perfect with the chili crisps. <laughs> like chocolate chili ice cream. It will, but I'm not sure the cheese and onion are particularly a, a, What? You, know. you don't like Pringles and chocolate? Like, like No. Anyway, this milk chocolate flavour, and it's a milk bar. Um, you've eaten that chocolate now. What did you think? Vegan chocolate. This little one can't have dairy. We are not essentially vegan through strictly vegan but this food i know that we can snack down on and she's not going to have any adverse effects to um so the idea from love raw they had an idea to make chocolate that tastes like chocolate it doesn't have any savory addition to it it doesn't have that slight too chocolatey flavor because there's nothing in it it just tastes like really good milk chocolate so fantastic love raw we love it now, I don't want to share this. Do you remember? Lockdown is taking its toll in that it's making me think, I don't want to share that with my kids. Of course I'm going to share it with you. I'm on camera. <laughs> of course I'm going to share it with you. Please. Of course I am. But it's, though, mums out there, I know if you're with me or you think, you know, tell me that you've not bought something and eaten it in the cupboard because you didn't want anyone else to hear you eat it. So. This one yeah, is a Mallow Puffs vegan dark chocolate salted caramel marshmallow bar. Super puffy vegan marshmallow bar whipped with salted caramel and dunked in Belgian dark chocolate. These Mallow bars are vegan certified, palm oil free and made with natural ingredients. No puff, just puff. And the palm oil thing, as well as the ecological damage that palm oil does, palm oil is 80% saturated fat and it's it's just not good for your body so I'm gonna cut little tiny pieces there we go marshmallows oh, it is the most beautiful look at that squish look at the color as well look at it what do you think pop it do you like marshmallow no. you love marshmallows yellow white marshmallow. Mm. Yellow. it's caramel You love them. Mm -hmm. You love the love raw. That's definitely your favourite. That is delicious. It's delicious. It is so good. It is absolutely squirmy. Mm. Oh. <laughs> can you get the caramel flavour? I can. Mm. I taste more. It's very subtle. I taste more Belgium and marshmallow like mixed together. I think because like of the dark cake. chocolate. Yeah, it tastes like a, like a, a tea, tea, cake. tea cake. Um, but because of the dark chocolate, it's, it might be overpowering the salted caramel a bit. But I said that white chocolate or milk chocolate would have been too sweet. So yeah, you've got to have some chocolate on it, which is just, I mean, just going to get a splodge. So <laughs> she just. So you're just chowing down on that. What was your favourite item tonight? What was your favourite item? Cheese. The chocolate, yeah, we don't need to ask that. Love Raw, thank you. You've made us a uh, little girl very, very happy. Um, what was My your favourite? was the banana crisps. The banana crisps, yeah. They are really, really good. But crisps, eeny, meeny, miny, moe. I've got to go, Mr. Things. They are just amazing. They're not as healthy. They're potatoes or yeah. per bag as well, because that was a smaller bag, I think. This is a whole bag full Daddy can have. Hmm. I love that. And I really, really love this one. This is great. Mm, 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 mm. So, anyway. <laughs> I'm just watching us eat. <laughs> Stay tuned for watching us eat the rest of this food. Oh, it's so spicy. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> it is so hot. <clears throat> so hot. Anyway. Thank you for watching another box. We would love it if you could give us a subscribe, please, because then you will know when we're eating more food or placing Click another video. Bell. Ring that bell. Ding, 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 ding. You're eating. You ding, missed ding, your ding, chance. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye. Smash. Smash that button. We are going to be doing a cookery video next, coming right up. So, please. 
subscribe, ring the bell, and give us some love. Comments appreciated. Bye-bye.